Man, this episode is gonna be one of the best Monopoly HUD episodes yet. Yo, what's going on Leaf Nation? It's Leafer back again and welcome back to the channel. Today we are here with Monopoly number 9 and guys, we have a lot of stuff to do. First things first, we were able to buy a uh, base Artemi Panarin, so we have to upgrade him twice because he did get two goals last episode. So now we have Artemi Panarin up to an 87. So there is base Artemi right there. Bang. And we get to get him up to an 88 as well. We unlocked another synergy, which is nice. Um, so we, yeah, we get to upgrade him up to an 88. We have two power up collectibles ready and 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 ready to go for him. We have one more upgrade because he did get a special card since last episode. So we could get him up to an 89 once he does get upgraded. But 88 Panarin looks amazing. We have balanced on him. Applesauce would be good. What is bombarded? Okay, so applesauce is our best bet right now. So we get that and we get an extra. Um, superstar ability as well so hey uh that panarin looks amazing on that first line second thing second we have a rewards available we're gonna go untradeable here the more packs the better the more upgrades that we could possibly get so let's confirm that two mega packs right there and wait for this guys we have enough for the x factor player choice pack so we're gonna get to have another x factor player on our team we're hoping for the best there so complete the set we got some big boy packs to open here uh, before we roll the dice and an X Factor player to open as well. So let's get right into it here. So we'll start with the player packs and then we got Omega packs as well. So player packs, we get 180 plus overall players. See what we can get in here. I think we finished silver. Um, maybe gold. I, I, I can't really remember. Uh, Ilya Sorokin, not really going to help with the team, but uh, good cards that uh, will help for sets. Pavel Buchnevich, not too bad at an 82. And that's it in that one, not too shabby. Another player's pack here. Another player's pack here. I, I can't talk again. Shocker there. Uh, all right, Dustin Wolf. Who's gonna be our 80 plus player? 81 Joe Faraby. Not too bad. Anyone else? Negative. All good. It's kind of messed up that I'm okay with not getting anything because we got the X Factor Choice pack, but I do want to get something. So we got a mega pa mega pack here. 30 items, at least 15 gold players, four 80 plus overall players. Give me something good here. Yeah, these are big packs, so we're gonna try to go through them quickly here. Uh, we get a hut uh, icon, Eric Condra. I didn't even know he had a hut icon. That, that's something. Uh, no 80 plus players yet. I don't believe so. So let's see what we can get. Barbashev, all right. Not the greatest. Still a lot of this pack left, man. I, I always forget how big these mega packs are. And I guess it's really in the name, eh? Boom Jenner there. Uh, skip the rest. Kapokako. And a Bob Gainey. Um, okay. Next mega pack. We're going to skip this one, all right? I have, I have a feeling. Bo Horvat. Doesn't look like an 86 pluses. We had a couple 81 pluses maybe. Uh, let's see what they are. Let's see what they are. Hopefully something good. Drake Batherson. Jack Campbell. Hampus Lindholm isn't too bad. Besides that, nothing to help the team out. Not the greatest rivals packs, but it's okay. We got our X Factor Choice pack next. And here we are, boys. Select an X Factor player. We have five choices out of this. McDavid. McKinnon um matthews um dry Seidel, any of those guys would be great first card mark shifley not too bad to go along with kyle connor not too shabby nathan mckinnon that's a w boys that is a huge w for nate mack we can get him up to an 89 once he starts scoring some goals nathan mckinnon that's huge at a 77 next patrick kane not too bad we still take mckinnon over kane though eichel all right and last but not least Lanniskog. So no brainer. Uh, Nathan McKinnon, welcome to the team, buddy. So McKinnon's ideally going to come in for... Uh, I want to keep Verhage because he's been good and he has a synergy activated for us too. Uh, realistically, McKinnon's going to come in to play second line center. Um, yeah, maybe. Yeah, so we can get him some upgrades. So let's do this real quick. All right, so the lines are looking good. We got Panarin, Patterson, Marchand. Pretty good first line. Second line with that Marner, McKinnon, Connor. Hopefully we can get McKinnon some upgrades here, get him a couple goals. Maybe if we can get him up to like an 81 or an 83 this episode, that'd be huge. Uh, he's playing alongside Connor as well. We got Kachuk, Zibanejad, Raquel, Hornquist, Monaghan, Verhage, not too bad. Uh, defense is looking the same and goaltending is looking the same as well. So uh, it's a good looking team, boys. I'm excited to start upgrading this McKinnon. Uh, without further ado, we actually have to go roll the dice and potentially open up some more packs, which is actually crazy because I feel like we've done so much already. All right, guys. So last time we left off on special packs. Let's see what we can get here. Hopefully something good. Rolling for the first time this episode. And we get a four. Okay, okay. So fours open up one premium pack. Um, 
All right, well, let's hope for some luck here. Also, I forgot to mention, I will be changing the board next episode. I was supposed to do it for this one. I, I just didn't have the time to. So we will be changing the board, potentially adding some more special packs to the board, some 82 plus sets, all that good stuff. So eventually we will be updating the board. Next episode is when it should be updated. So sorry about that, guys. I've been meaning to update it. I just haven't done it yet. We will get through it or we will get to it eventually as we pull absolutely nothing in this pack. All right, guys, let's go and try and upgrade this McKinnon to Connor. Maybe get Panarin one more upgrade as he has one more to be upgraded. I'm excited to try out this team, man. First game here, Morand, Pekka, Kaprizov. Pretty decent team. Let's see what we can do here, boys. All right, Matthew Samuelson. This guy's got a really good team, so this shall be interesting here, boys. Let's see what we can do. We got a good cycle going. Get that across. Victor Hedman. Oh, my God, what a shot. So McKinnon's puck and, and no one else's. Oh my goodness, almost got that upgrade for Connor there. If that got through, that might have went in, to be honest. That goes wide. Monaghan, out of boy. Up across. Ricard Raquel, let's go. Saucer. Verhage, horrible. Oh, that almost went in. I was going to say horrible shot. That almost trickled in somehow. Wow. Patrick Hornquist. Eric Johnson. Oh, that was risky. What a deflection almost worked. In front, Verhage. What a save from Demko. What a way to end the period, man. It's a 0-0 zero -zero hockey game, though. End of one, it's a 0-0 zero -zero hockey game. It's it's actually been a pretty close game, so I, I can't really complain about anything. We got to try to pot one in here. I apparently took a penalty when I was controlling Hedman. What, what, what happened here? A slash. Apparently, I slashed. Where did Panarin slash? Apparently, that's a slash. Good game. That gets through Muzzin. I absolutely hate that. It's a one nothing hockey game off a dumb penalty. Uh, what are you going to do, man? And this is might be another goal. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wow. Dude, every poke, he just gets a puck back. I don't know if because his, his players are rated higher. Than, oh, my God. Hornquist, go. Breakaway. Patrick Hornquist. Bang. Oh, my God. What a save from Demko. Good pass. Over to Marshan. What a saucer pass. And of course, I'm going to get robbed. Over across. Ricard Raquel. Oh my goodness. I cannot score a goal this game. And a two. We're losing one nothing. It's still a very even game. I can't get one past Thatcher Demko. What? What? Over Is this just his base card? Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Uh, let's score here, boys. Oh my. Both my players went in for that puck. They both didn't come out with that. That's insane. Oh my Vasilevsky, I'm gonna need a save from you, brother. Ah, it's just so easy for my opponents. I hate it. There you go, Marner. Over across, McKinnon. It went in. I, it didn't look like it went in. That's a McKinnon upgrade. We're, we're, one more goal and we're tied. One more goal and we're tied. Let's go, Namak. We love that. There you go, Hornquist. Straight line, beautiful. Over to Connor. There it is. That's a Kyle Connor upgrade too. 2-2 two, two hockey game. Let's go. We're winning this. We are winning this right now. What a move. One second. Just take a shot. All right. We're heading to OT. There's never much love when you go OT. Looking at the stats here. I mean, time on attack, we're dominating. He's dominating in shots, I guess. It's anyone's game, man, honestly. Down to Marchand. You're fine, Brad. Across McKinnon, uh, like there, there was three people on him. That probably wasn't the smartest pass. Turn around, Latang. Stupid of me. My players are dead tired. Latang gets flat-footed because he doesn't know how to skate backwards. Apparently, we lose three-two. I'm not a fan of that. I, I don't think we should have lost that game. In all honesty, man. So looking here quickly, what upgrades do we get? McKinnon gets a plus one upgrade, and Kyle Connor gets a plus one upgrade. Looking at the stats here, I maybe I got to shoot more. I don't know. It's a tough loss, man. It really is. We completed an objective here, so let's go collect those coins. It's an extra 200 coins. We need every coin we can get now after buying base McKinnon, or uh, base uh, Panera in all honesty. So that's all good. But look in here. We do get uh, some upgrades on our second line. Kyle Connor going up to an 84. Um, so we're going to have to go purchase Kyle Connor's base and then McKinnon gets a plus one upgrade, which is going to cost us 500 coins. That's nothing. So he's up to a 79 right now, which is very nice to see. Synergy-wise, uh, does Bombarded help us out? Not really. So we'll keep it on Applesauce. 
and uh, let's go buy a base Connor. You can get a Kyle Connor for just under 4k, so don't mind if I do. And now we got Kyle Connor up to an 83, so let's go do that quickly. Here we are, Kyle Connor is now at an 84 overall, my mistake. And that card's looking good as well with that card art. We absolutely love to see it. And he gets another synergy unlocked. What will that be? Uh, bombarded applesauce that'll help us out we get that at tier 8 so we can get him up to an 85 next time around uh so it's looking good man the team is looking better um yeah let's just uh go to the board and roll the dice for the second time this episode all right so we are back at the board uh we're looking to get something good here boys so here we go rolling the dice for the second and final time this episode and we get a three so a three is pink slip so this is the first time we've landed on it this series uh so let me explain it to you before we head into a game now this might be a little hard to do with the uh, coin sum that we do have after upgrading our uh, connor and our mckinnon but uh what we're gonna do is we're gonna head into the next game if we win our uh win the game that we play against our opponent we get to look at his team and whatever player i want to throw into my team i get to take from his team so let's say he has a 87 overall austin matthews if i win and I like that 87 overall Matthews, I can go to the marketplace and buy him and put him onto my team. So uh, it's gonna be interesting. We only have 3,100 coins. I don't know who we're gonna be able to get. Hopefully 3,100 coins can give us an upgrade somewhere. Again, that is if we do win. So let's hop into a game and let's see what we can do here. Second game of the episode, 89 Duchesne, 89 McKinnon, 91 Crosby. Another good team here. Oh man, why are we coming up against such good teams? Actually, that could be good that we're coming up against a good team because if we do win, we could take one of those players off of his team. Again, I don't know if I have the coins for it though, so let's see what happens here, boys. Across, over to Pedersen. What a pass. What a, what a defensive play from him. I'll give it to him. Oh, no, we're in trouble. There we go. Mitch, I see you. Quick pass. Nice. McKinnon to Marner. What a poke from Hellbuck. I hate that. Get that across. Kyle Connor. Oh my goodness, dude. How do we not have a goal yet? We are dominating. There you go. Brady Kachuk. Ricard Raquel. To Kachuk. What a save, dude. Hellbuck is standing on his head against us right now. Let's go. What a pass. That's a penalty shot from his knees. Brad Marchand. What a goal, dude. Are you kidding me? Brad Marchand, you are nasty. What a goal. Let's watch this thing back. He trips me. I'm on my knees. Scores. one nothing hockey game. Let's go. What? That, that is actually an insane goal, dude. That is a highlight real goal if I've ever seen one in high. Let's go. Panarin, quick pass. Beautiful. Back over to Panarin. One hand. Bang. <gasps> Off the post, dude. Almost two highlight real goals in one period. Oh, my goodness, man. That would have been nice. And that would have been an upgrade for Panarin, too. Carter Verhage across. If only there was like a sliver of time left, it would have been a 2 0 hockey game. Great first period. I can't hate. Looking at this Brad Marchand goal again. Oh my god, that is actually filthy, dude. Posting in. Oh my god. End of one. It's 1 0 us. Looking at these stats, uh, deservedly so. Got a boy. Here we go, Marchand. What a pass to Marner. Over to Marchand. Hello? Over across, bang. Oh, Monaghan didn't shoot, but Patrick Hornquist will. 2 nothing hockey game. Whew. Let's go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, dude, I tried playing it as Vasilevsky. I knew he was going for the pass across. Horrible, just horrible play for me, man. 2-1 hockey game. I, I need to smarten up. Look at this guy's team. There you go, Patrick Hornquist. Bang, Zabinajad. Oh my god, another great save from, from Hellbuck there. Big shocker. Hornquist, another great save. My god. Bang, Carter Verhage. Oh my god, what a saucer pass. Bang. There we go, Carter Verhage makes it a two-goal game again. Give me a rage quit, please, and thank you. No rage quit, no timeout. I am very confused. And a two, it's three to one. I, we're dominating. Just plain and simple. Pedersen gets a puck. Beautiful. Over across to Panarin. Oh my god. Bang. And there it is. Brad Marchand makes it a 4-1 hockey game. Great first shift from this first line. They were on from the start of the period. Uh, line changes aren't a thing. Kyle Connor. Bang. That's a Kyle Connor upgrade. We have him fully upgraded now. Let's go Kyle Connor. 5-1 hockey game. They're giving that a penalty shot. That's insane. That's fine. We're making the save. 
Here we are, boys. One thing you don't know about me. I'm an uh, elite goaltender, sure. Here we go. Let's go, Vasilevsky. Yep, elite. I'm just elite at goaltending. What can I say? That was actually dirty. Oh my god, if that went in. Connor wants one more goal. Doesn't matter. He's fully upgraded. Make it 6 1 with 6.7 to go. Let's go. And that's game. What a game. We got some big upgrades and we won the pink slip challenge. So we get to take someone off of his team. Close to silver ranking, which is always nice to see. We got some extra coins there. Looking at our team quickly. Kyle Connor. So Marchand with two goals. Kyle Connor with two goals. So Connor is fully upgraded now. And none of our other X Factors got a goal. Looking at his team, who do we want to take off of his team here? So he's got the 91 Crosby. It's got to be something, someone that we can afford to do. So let's see what we can do here. This guy has an unreal team, like with no base cards, man. Um, I think our best bet is um, maybe that Seth Jones where we can try and make him. If not, uh, we're not going to be able to get anyone, man, because his team is full of X-Factors and Master Set players. We don't have the funds for that. Get a premium pack for taking 250 shots on goal, so that's something. We're up to 4.4k right now. So like I said, we, we can't. the only player we were able to buy off of his team was he had a base of Deno Chara for some reason. I don't know what that was about, but uh, yeah, that's something. So we need one power-up collectible to get Kyle Connor up to an 85. Let's go make one real quick. Uh, boys, uh, we have another X-Factor player choice pack available. We'll save that for next episode. Okay, that's interesting, boys. We're going to have another X-Factor player on our team come next episode. That's awesome. Now, to look at making this set Jones here, man. I don't know. I don't remember how much this costs. It might cost a pretty penny in all honesty. So an 82 plus player, we might be able to do this. Okay, so let me try making this set Jones. I think we might be able to do it, boys. All right, boys. So we're missing two 83 plus players here that we can throw in here. So right now we have an 85 set Jones, which is really nice to see. We'll send these guys to the collection just for now. But we do need 283 plus players, so we're close to getting that Seth Jones. But thanks to the guy that we just played and won against, we get an upgrade there with Seth Jones. So looking here, Kyle Connor is now going to be up to an 85, which is absolutely huge to see. He scored two goals last game, so uh, he's upgraded to an 85, which is very nice to see. Um, and do we have... Applesauce is now activated, which is very nice to see. So that's going to give us... Uh, plus two to hand eye, plus plus four to passing, plus four to stick checking, and plus two to rich out accuracy for Panarin, Connor, Latang, McKinnon, and Raquel. That is huge. And now looking at um, our defense, uh, I think Rasmus Anderson is going to be the odd man out. We're going to be putting in Sethery Jones here, which is very nice to see. We'll be close to getting him up to an 86 when we pull a couple more 83 overalls. But Seth Jones will now be playing top line minutes with Victor Hedman. The team's looking very good, boys. What an end to this episode and what an episode it's been. Anyways, guys, that's it for today's Monopoly HUD episode. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Guys, next episode is, is, is going to be another good one. We have another X Factor player choice pack. Hopefully, we can get a McDavid or a Crosby. We did get lucky with our McKinnon. What an episode it's, it's been today. Uh, next one uh, should follow up to be another great one. So, guys, like I said, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!